Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to day two of October. So, okay, so the other day I woke up, it was yesterday, yeah, I woke up and Bae, he um, built everything for me in my office so far, like everything that I have here. So let me just show you guys it so far. And I just cleaned it up today, but um, well, I'll try to do my best. So we walk in, We're so far, like it's still messy. I have all this to bring home, bring the suitcases over there and my suitcases over there. And then I have more mess over here, but yeah, so we walk in and then I still think I'm gonna move this. I still have not removed the stickers off this yet. I think I might put the little bookshelf thing that I have over here and then put the mirror in the living room. And um, yeah, so he built the couch. It's cute, but I kind of want to paint the or spray paint the bottoms because I don't like the brown color. I want to like spray paint it silver or something, but I don't know. We'll see. Um, but yeah, that's how it looks. I need to get more pillows. I don't care what Brian says. I'm making it girly as F. I'm getting fluffy ass pillows. <laughs> So I have the couch over here, and then I have the desk thing over here. So I do have two chairs just because one is for me and one is for Brian. So I ended up putting the desk right here just because it created more space. So I have like a lot of space in the middle and I can move things around. And then also because when I'm editing videos, if I ever want to edit videos on the table, even though that's not what it's for, it's mainly for filming purposes. Um, but yeah, if I do want to edit on here, I have like, I can look out outside and it's not just like boring like I'm looking at a TV or like at a wall or something like that. So I put it so I can face outside and have just some natural light while I'm editing and you know, get some inspiration. But yeah, so that's it so far. Um, I got a few packages that I want to show you guys and I'm also going to um, try to set this up and see how it looks behind the couch because... Um, there's like a little space behind here, which I didn't know was going to be like that because it is a futon. But yeah, I'm going to try to put the light behind here somewhere so I can see how it is when it like brightens up or whatever. I don't know how that's going to look, but we are going to see. But yeah, I got a few packages and, you know, I cannot wait to straighten my hair. I'm straightening my hair this month, October, because I'm so tired of doing my hair every single day. And yeah, so... I don't know if you guys heard about this product, the Black Castor Oil and Flaxseed Moisture Rich Leave-In Conditioner, but I heard um, Smartista Beauty, she tried it and she said it's so, so good and moisturizing, so I'm like, before I straighten my hair, I'm going to try this out, and uh, what else did I get? Hold on. Let me get some scissors, and I also want to try it with the, um, the gel because I haven't yet to try the Black um, castor oil and flaxseed gel so I want to try these two together so it also came with this satin bonnet right here which whatever why not <laughs> and then what I didn't know I ordered two of the Denman brushes what that's annoying whatever I'll bring one home and then I'll leave one here but I got two Denman brushes and I have I haven't tried a Denman brush before so I'm excited to try this out um, I'm probably gonna film that tomorrow even though I just washed my hair yesterday and my curls have come back to life I did do a protein treatment so that is why shout out to everybody who suggested that I don't know why I didn't think of that myself because when I do do protein treatments my curls start popping again so I feel like I got my curls are popping again. Still a little bit frizzy, but is my hair always frizzes up, so that's no big deal. So I can't wait to try these things out. And when I get back here from Toronto, I am straightening my hair. And I will be filming it, so don't worry about that. Ugh. So I also want to show you guys this package that I got from the Naked, Naked Wardrobe. So I have been wanting some army jeans for the longest time and I finally found the perfect pair. Well, I hope they're perfect because I hope they fit me. But I got these from the Naked Wardrobe in a size small. So they're just like high-waisted army jeans. I feel like they look a little bit more different on the website, but I don't know. I could be wrong. But let me just try it on for you guys and show you guys. So this is what they look like on exactly what I wanted. 
They are pretty tight fitting, which is what I kind of wanted. And then a little bit baggy towards the bottom. And yeah, I like it. It's nice and high waisted, so I'll wear like a um, a bodysuit with it or something like that. Um, the only thing is, is like the back sticks out a little bit, but what jeans don't do that? So I like these a lot. So I have all of this stuff right here that I'm trying to bring back with me to Toronto on Thursday to give away, but it's not fitting in my carry-on. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. So I have all of this stuff right here. Some of them I'm still gonna try on and decide if I want to keep them or not. I know a lot of you guys are saying I should make like a Depop and um, sell my things, but I don't know. I'm just, I'm lazy to do that. Like I feel like that's so much work. And then. Like, why not give it to my friends and family? I'm gonna try on a bunch of these things, and I wanna, I want you guys to let me know if I should keep them or not, because I'm not sure. Okay, so this is the first thing, this white bodysuit right here, and I'm just debating on throwing it away while well, giving it away, because I don't know, I just feel like it doesn't do anything for me. Like, give me a little bit of cleavage, or like, push my boobs together or something. It's just really simple, but I guess that's what bodysuits are. I'm trying to hide my nipples. But, um, yeah, it's really, really simple. It's the back. I don't know if you guys can see that. I have I had it for a minute now and I just have not worn it. That's the only reason why I'm thinking about giving it away, but I don't know. I might wear it, but I might not. I think I'm gonna keep it for a little while longer and then give it away. But let me know what you guys think. Should I keep it? Yay or nay. Next we have this warm ass cardigan. Like this is one of the softest cardigans that I ever like had in my possession. Still new tags on it. Color is nice and everything, but I don't really wear cardigans like that anymore. So that's why I'm like, might as well just give this away. I think my sister would appreciate it more than I do. So that's why I'm like, maybe I should just give it to her. And then if I ever want to wear it, just go in her closet. But like, it's really soft. It's nice. Oh my gosh. I feel like I want to keep it now. <laughs> now that I put it on. But I don't know. I think, oh my God, it's actually really nice though. I actually might keep this for myself. Hmm. <laughs> What do you guys think? This is another debatable item. Okay, so the next thing is this top right here. And I got this from Zara when they were having like that big sale. The annual sale or whatever it is. Quarterly sale. I don't know what they have. But um, I like the colors on it. The, the orange, reds, the yellows, the blues. I just don't like how it fits at the bottom. It's so loose. I'm like, can it just be a little bit tighter? I don't know. That's just how I feel about it. Like maybe that's just the style. Debating about keeping it. I got it for the summer when I, when it was the summer and I haven't worn it since. I'm like, maybe I'll wear it on vacation or something, but I'm not quite sure. I like how it goes off the shoulder like this, but I just don't like the fit of it too much. So it's like, if I don't like the fit, then why am I keeping it, you know? Woo, fly. But I'm still debating on this as well. Like, you guys are going to be my deciding vote, honestly. Okay, so this is the last item that I'm going to show you guys. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice got all raspy. But I got this from Misguided. I actually forgot to show this in my Misguided haul. Because it was just, like, somewhere hiding in the corner. But, um, yeah. So I got this mainly because it's dressy. And I don't have a lot of dressy things. So I'm usually, like, casual wherever I go. Or, like cute casual or whatever you want to call it but this is a little bit this is dressy you know dressy for me at least and i love how it has like the deep v i like the color so i thought it'd be perfect for like fall um but i don't know if i'd wear it that's the thing like i feel like i don't go much places so it's like i feel like somebody else might do better with this than i would but then again it is really nice and you know if i ever go out to dinner and i want to wear it then i have something but i don't know let me know what you guys think. I know I'm asking you guys a lot, but I would love you guys' opinion. And if you guys are interested in any of these pieces, like the pants, the shirt, any of the other things that I showed you guys, it will be linked down below. But yeah, this is the last thing. So let me know which pieces I should keep and which ones I should give away. So guys, I finally got it to work. It's such a super easy installation. Like it literally took less than two minutes. So got that but I just have to stick it on where I want it to go and how I want it to be I'm not really sure but I just want to see how it would work and literally it can be whatever color I want it to be so it comes with this little remote right here and it just it gives such vibes though I love the vibes but um so you have this remote right here where it has like all these different colors got the blue going we got the green 
We got the red. Ooh. And we could also make like custom colors. Like I'm going to try to do yellow. See yellow. Yellow. Ooh, it's so fall. Nice and orange. Um, let's try. Let's go back to the greens. Let's do this bluish green. This is dope. Bright, bright blue. I'm in love, guys. Um, but obviously, I got it mainly for purple. Like, this is like a blue purple, another purple, and then a, like a brighter purple. I love this. And you can also do white. So like the, there's white, and then you can do like a a pink white. Oh my god! You can see so there's white, so you can do like pink. You can do like a light blue and like a darker blue. Flash? What happens if I do flash? Whoa! It's a party! Oh my god! This is sick. Let me put on purple party. It's gonna be a purple party. Now flash. Oh, does it only do white flashes? What? How do I do this? Not every time I do it, it changes to to white, but I'm, I feel like there's a way that I can change it, but I'm in love. I'm in love. <sighs> Anyways, guys, I'm gonna chill in my room for the rest of the day until Brian gets home and edit videos and stuff because like, I feel like it's coming together so perfect and I'm just loving the vibe, especially with the lights, it's everything. So yeah, if you guys are interested in these lights, I did get them from Amazon and I got two of them, so I don't know, I'm gonna deck out this room, y'all. But yeah, guys, anyways, I'm gonna get to editing this video. I did just film a part to one of my videos, just the first part. The next part is gonna be filmed tomorrow. So yeah, I'm trying to get in as much curly videos as possible because once I straighten my hair, I'm gonna have my hair straight for a whole month. Guys, it actually feels so good to be sitting at a desk for once because I don't have a desk. You guys know that at home, so I literally work from my couch. I do everything sitting down from my couch and on my bed so i don't feel like i don't feel that productive and stuff so i feel so good that i have a desk thanks to my bae again for allowing me to have this space and just for putting everything together because i just feel better like i feel good like i'm doing something you know so i'm here at my desk editing my wash and go video here it is starting from the shower this is pretty much my in the shower <laughs> routine because literally i do my wash and goes now in the shower i don't come out of the shower at all because my hair dries up super fast so i've been in the shower and doing my whole entire routine so i'm just sitting here sipping on some water having my candles lit and then i have my little lights in the background i have to put it together still but i just don't know how i want it yet but I feel good. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, I'm gonna get to editing this video. I just have to do my voiceover, but you guys know how I feel about voiceovers because of the way I talk. I literally have to say things over like 5,000 times and it still sounds horrible. So yeah, I'm just praying because this is actually gonna be, I'm going on to my October, this is going to be my fourth month. So July, August, August, September, September, October. So yeah, this is actually going to be my fourth month with the expander in. And I just hope that like after month four, I can take it out. I'm going to be so happy. You guys don't understand. Um, my orthodontist appointment is on Friday. So we're going to see what it says then. I just hope that I made enough progress where, you know, it's soon time to come out yeah anyways i'm gonna get on to editing this video hopefully i can finish it by today because it is supposed to go up tomorrow wednesday when this video is supposed to go up so after you're done finished watching this vlog go over and watch my hair routine for in the shower <laughs> oh my gosh hi <laughs> guys i'm home from work and I've been playing 2K since I got here. I just want to show y'all my face swap. It kind of looked like you, boy. Oh, shit. So I had the app on my phone. Hit the face swap. Shanice said it's, a, it's two years down the road. Because I only... Two I, years? I, I had to like pick five. the least amount of facial hair. And that was a choice. 
but you know, you know the 30, 32 year old me. He blinking and shit. Ooh, that nigga alive. He got a heartbeat, a pulse. Let me know what you guys think. Does this look like me in the comments? You think it look like me, Shanice? Good morning, guys. So, I totally forgot to finish the vlog yesterday. Um, like I said, I don't do much throughout the day, especially during the the weekdays, because all I'm doing in the house is filming or editing. Don't really go outside much unless I'm getting food. Um, yeah. So, if my vlogs are boring, I'm sorry, but this is pretty much what I do um, every single day. Um, I'm actually going to Toronto tomorrow, so um, that vlog should be interesting. Um, I'm actually going to a gender reveal. My, one of my good, good friends from a long time, Amanda, is having her baby, so I'm so, so excited to share that with you guys. So yeah, I'm about to finish filming this video. Um, this is the second part, and then I'm probably going to hop in the shower and then film another video um, using these products right here, because I really want to try them out. I heard a lot about them. The only thing is that I put on makeup for this video and then I have to go in the shower and wash my hair and do this shit all over again. But I'm doing the try. I'm gonna try not to get my face because <laughs> I don't want to take out this makeup because me and Brian are probably gonna film later today too when it comes home from work. So yeah. Um hopefully this vlog wasn't too boring. Um again, if you guys want those lights that I um showed you guys, I will link them down below as well as the little clothing pieces that I showed you guys earlier on. So yeah, I'll see you guys all on Friday. Mwah!